Welcome to another plugin tutorial. I'm going to show you how to use the Shop GUI Plus plugin. There will be a link that will bring you here. All you have to do is press on download. Go to your server, go to file manager, go to plugins, and drag and drop the plugin into the plugins folder. I have it right here. To check to see if you have installed the plugin correctly, do slash PL. If the plugin shows up in green, then you have installed it correctly. With this plugin, players can do slash shop and they will bring up this GUI. These are all the different shops in the plugin, blocks, food, ores, tools, etc. This is the person's balance that you can set in the configuration. Let's take a look at the config. Go to your server, go to file manager, go to plugins, go to shop GUI plus, go to config. From here, scroll down. This is where you can set up the shop menu name. This will be shown at the top. If you keep scrolling down, you can set up the left click for buy, right click for sell, or you could just delete it, which I'm gonna leave it. Top menu items, number one, grass block. Quantity, one, this is gonna say blocks on it. This is for shop blocks. This has to be the same as your shop ID from the shop's YM. AML. We will take a look at that later. This is the slot that is in. First slot is zero. So, you know, you have nine squares for the hot bar. It will be like zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, instead of starting from one. Now, let's take a look at the shops. Go back to shop GUI plus. Go to on shops. These are all the shops. Let's take a look at the blocks. Right up here is the shop ID thing shop UID. You have to copy this and place it there for what the shop is. Then this will be displayed at the top of it. Your first item, it's an item, grass block, quantity 64. So buying or selling 64 at a time. Buy price is 50, sell price is 5. It starts at slot 10. So if you have two of the same in the same slot, one of them is probably not going to show up. And if you keep going down, you will see that it will back to here. Make sure to write page two when you're putting it on the next page, or it's just going to keep going into the same page, and then an error will show up in the console and will be all messed up. So I'm going to load up the plugin how I set it up so you can take a look at it. All right, I use a backup to go back to how I have it set up. Now if I do slash shop, I have it where it says money right here and color blocks. So if you press on money, you can sell gold. This for one, this for 25 cents, 225 and 2025. 20, I also have color blocks. So this will be 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. This is in slot 10. And next page, terracotta, concrete, stained glass. Also to note, you need a economy plugin like Essentials. And to make the economy work, you need the vault plugin. So you need an economy plugin and vault. Or none of this is going to work in the first place. I'm going to show you the, how I have the configuration set up to what this is. Go to your server, go to file manager, go to plugins, go to GUI plus, go to shops, and then color block. Pretty much the same thing. This is on page two, but this is still counting up. If I go to go out of this, go to shop GUI plus, go to config, and I scroll down right here, shop menu items, number one, gold ingot, the name, and shop money. That was at the top from the other screen. Number two, white wool, color blocks, and I named it color blocks in the GUI. That's it for this plugin tutorial, and bye.